Assalamu alaikum to my Muslim brother and sisters. Now, welcome to another episode. Today, we want to talk about mercy and kindness. My name is Abdul Bashir Balogun. And we get our Imam Junaid Abdul Qadri. We go lecture us more on top of this matter. Assalamu alaikum, Imam. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Over to you, Imam. Allah. Allah, oh ya, la tifu, Allah, oh barere, a tuti de, Allah, oh baolu, boa, Allah, oh ya, ramanu, Allah, oh baua, be, Allah, ah, baua, be, Allah, ramu, be, a tui, de, da, palio. Allah, Allah, أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وقلم لله السلام على عباده الذين صفا أو خير أما يسبوا أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. We give thanks to Allah. Alhamdulillah. We now pray that Allah's blessing should be showered upon all his Jewish personalities. Amen. Raj Muhammad. Down to all of us that are following this. Wala dadu ki Rasul Allah yauma wa man ahala salat ala Muhammad wa man ahala salat ala Muhammad. May this salat be showered upon Prophet Muhammad. Allah Alaihi My name is Blaid Abdul Qadri. You are welcome to your program. Ramadan Tafsir on Mazobia Television. The Kudratil Light, we are going to talk about Al Rahmatu Wa Rifu. Al Rahmatu Wa Rifu. Mercy and kindness. Mercy and kindness. Allah says, Allah says in Surah Al Allah says, Rabbana. Why you are that 
declare and to keep bounty for them out of concern for them. The mercy from Allah is to be gracious, his graciousness and favor he has been showering upon us. Mercy from Adam and Eve. is human being, the, the children of Adam. Are uh, those Islamic or Quranic vocabulary calls are uh, damage you? So, the message from human being that is from me and you, from I and you, is to do what? Because what I to, to be gentle with one another. Just be gentle. Husband should have mercy on wives, be gentle with your wife. Wives should have. Mercy on husband, be gentle with your husband. Community leaders with their inhabitants, country with their people, the world with one another. Be gentle with one another. Gentleness and compassion are what are required of them. What is kindness? What is grateful? Grateful means for you to be. Accommodating, lean only, Do not be too kind. Do not have uh, 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 an attitude of an idea. In literature, we call it iconoclastic attitude. Iconoclastic. That is the, the mystic of self. That no, it is only me. It is because it's me. It's so uh, be kind to other people. Be mindful of their act desire to Allah Hakim. In action and in words. And also to resort to the easiest, easiest, unless it was religiously hateful or interdicted. So do not be too harsh on people. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He says, uh, "Yes, you." He said, "Make things easier for people." Don't make things difficult. Be glad tigers. Give me people glad tigers. Don't hate. Don't hate people. If you are kind, you will have this for attitude. You will have this for attitude. You will make things easy for people. You will not make things more difficult for people. You will be giving them good information. You will be motivational. Don't be a source of, no, I mean, Dorara. Uh, Don't be a source of punishment. Don't be a source of hardship to somebody. And do not allow them to be source of hardship to you. Al Quran now goes by saying that. Women and women. We are friends of one another. We are joining ourselves to the right. Why you keep Observing salat is very important. Why you do zakat? Paying zakat is very compulsory. Why you pay Allah and Rasulullah? And the following Allah and Prophet Muhammad is very, very significant. All the if you have these all these at, 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 attributes, attitude. Allah will soon, will soon shower his mercy upon 
Some people will be say that they made this life hard for their brother. But, but why? People, you don't know what the person they suffer and you say because they put more. Now you make me like them, our guy where they behind the scene. People like K Solo, Baba Abdu, Emeka, Mohammed. If you see them outside, they're nice. They feel even give you something. They be see, they, you know what that they talk about give away. If you see them, greet them well. Ah, uh, you don't, you don't, you don't, the luck where they follow you that day. Ah, uh, no be smarty. But more got this break, will they come back? My name is Nalukman Bankoli. I'm sending this video from sun water. The month of Ramadan, this month gives us opportunity to wipe away our sin. The month that we show love. The month of Ramadan is the month of receiving, the month of discipline, the month that teaches us how to live the rest of the year. So when, when month of Ramadan comes, some people adjust their life. At the end of the day, it will shape how they live their life for the rest of the year. And Many good things start coming into their life. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Abdul Bashir Balogo. I they send this video from BI. I want to know what Ramadan means to me. This month of Ramadan and only month, they be say any bad part of what we know say we they do, make we live up. You will not say they smoke before, live up. You will not say they drink before. Drink, we know they don't drink water. Or if they drink alcohol, if they take alcohol, you need to stop up. But that one no means after this month finish, make you can go back to her. No, that will not make you fear God. But you, where well, you know say, won't do this video too. Send them to at Wazobia Mass, either on Instagram or Twitter. On Instagram, hashtag Ramadan2020 with Wazobia. Thank you. You will just uh, join us. This program now, Ramadan 2020 Tafsil with Wazobia TV. And we they talk about Aramatu Warifku, mercy and kindness. Mercy and kindness. I don't mention one person name, that's Shino. Ah, this allergy good. This allergy they spend. But more go over to our imam, make our imam lecture us more. Imam, over to you. 
You do not have to let them be with you, continue making them your servants. Let them grow. Let them grow with you. Let them leave them alone after some while. Don't give them like 10 years, 15 years. Then let them go and establish their own too. They will be your pillar wherever they are going. And with that, you will be able to get other people that will match up with your need at that particular time. Then at that time, those you have been you have released will not be oh I can't. They will go and learn another thing. They will now bring a contemporary hand and mind to your company again. Your company too will be contemporary. Your company, your business too will be growing because you have new mind, fresh mind. New, why do you now want to be retaining, retaining a an employee for 20 years without giving them the necessary? Aisha says Allah is kind. Therefore, he lies kindness in all matters. All matters you lay your hand upon, Allah like kindness in me. This is a very good story that you want us to go with. It came from Abu Murayra. He said, Prophet Muhammad said, بينما رجل يمشي بطريق اشتد عليه العطش. We are going one day and a man was moving with us. The man was thirsty and uh, he was so much uh, frustrated with thirst. فوجد بئرا فنزل فيها فشرب. He now saw a well. He went down to the well. He started drinking water from the well. ثم خرج. When he quenched his thirst, when he, he, he quenched his thirst, he ascended, he left the well, he was about going. Then he now saw a dog which was panting and eating the earth. The man now looked at the dog. The man looked at the dog and now said, Oh, it's like the way I was thirsty of water is the way this dog is also thirsty of water. So I, I need to do something. We now, gave, we now went back to the well. It Throw he threw his slippers, his slippers, like an up shoe. That's the kind of slippers they used to wear then. He, he rope it up, he threw it inside the well. He now fetch water for the dog. He now gave the water to the dog. The dog drank the water. And the dog appreciated the man. Allah now used that to forgive the man. Allah now used that to reward the man. Allah now used that to make the man one of distinguished personalities. Hallelujah, And the people around Prophet Muhammad went back to Prophet Muhammad and said. They asked him that if we are taking care of animals, are we also going to receive reward from taking care of animals? Prophet Muhammad now said, Whatever we are kind to, even an animal, even a human being, even a snake, even a dog, even a cat, anybody, no matter what, you are going to receive your reward. Allah. And that your reward is the mercy of Allah. If you are merciful with people, Allah himself will be merciful with you. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala.
Imam don't try for us. Imam say kind. Key point, kind. Kind. Baba, be kind to your brother. Be kind to your sister. No make life difficult to another person. And see, you get one person I won't mention, I forget to mention him. He don't be like other people who I mentioned that time. He name now okay, Chuku. This one, if you meet her for store, <laughs> store, he go give you something. We need we need to change the name to okay store give away. But me, the point we say, make we be kind to people, I beg. I still remain Abdubashil Balogun. Now, yeah, we go close our shop until we open our shop another day. Masalam. Now, bye-bye. <laughs>